So yeah, introduce yourself and yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm Ian Monroe. I'm a member of the board of East Bay for Everyone. Okay. And you have a, a strong opinion about Prop 6? Yes. Okay. First of all, first, what is Prop 6? Like? So, like, here's the political context for Prop 6, is that it is a, um, basically a get-out-the-vote operation by Republicans to help their congressional races in, like, the Central Valley and the Orange County. So that's, like, literally why it's on the ballot. So they went out and got signatures and like got this whole thing on the ballot because they're trying to like keep Republicans in the House. Yeah, yeah. So it's a it gives it gives a you like oh so you don't really like your congressional rep, but you do want to come to the polls so you can come vote for this. And so what it is is it repeals SB one, which was a pretty uh, which increases the gas tax and taxes on cars and it also indexes the gas tax so we don't have to keep doing this because basically right now the gas tax is uh, just at a certain rate so essentially every year there's a there's a cut in the gas tax just automatically because of inflation so it's not indexed to inflation so basically every year it goes down yeah, it goes okay. down in real terms yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah okay. and what it does is it funds transit and infrastructure uh, and just like road maintenance so actually kind of funny one of the things republicans didn't like about SB1 was that it didn't build enough roads because to them that's that's what gas taxes are for for building new roads but uh, of course in California and most of the country uh, we actually have a big um, infrastructure maintenance problem so it, it addresses that mostly it addresses the maintenance problem by uh, making sure we're keeping the roads we have in good order and then also uh, it does do uh, ongoing funds for you know, BART and AC Transit and all that transit that we love. So just all kinds of transit, like fixing potholes, keeping BART running on time, all that kind of stuff. Yep. Okay, well, awesome. Um, okay, so I assume you are in favor? No. <laughs> no, 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 no one Prop 6. No, no one, one Prop, prop six. 6, right. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, that's pretty straightforward. Uh, yeah, so, because... The thing about Prop 6 is that I see this as kind of, it's a continuation of like the tax revolt that we first saw with Prop 13. Right. And so like, here's our legislature. They went to Sacramento, they made a really hard choice and raised the gas tax, which is really hard to do. And it's great that they did that. So kind of like we, the people of California need to support them. We need to have a revolt against this tax revolt, <laughs> kind of be uh, counter revolutionaries. Right. And, uh, yeah, kill this prop. The other thing the prop does is it actually makes it so in the future, any future gas tax will have to come before the voters. So it, it makes the Constitution itself even worse than it was before. And so lots of good reasons to vote against Prop 6. So no on 6. Right. Um, okay, last, the last thing I want to throw at you is, like, so East Bay for Everyone is, like, predominantly, right? We're about housing. How, how would we, like, make the connection you know what I mean? Like, if we're, if we're about housing, like, what you're saying makes perfect sense to me. And I'm mm. totally on board. But if I work someone, but if I'm, if I'm the newspaper for everyone, all I care about is housing, right? Why do I care about? Uh, so, kind of directly, you know, housing and transit and transportation have always been very connected. And you can't really have one without the other. A house is a place it's located so you can get to work somewhere and, and to have fun in the city or whatever. So, these things are very related. Um, I think also kind of more broadly and kind of philosophically is like, do we want government to do things? Do we want to pay for government? And I think at least pay for everyone, we believe the answer is, yes, actually, we need government to help us solve this housing crisis. And yes, we want our politicians to make hard choices. And so when they make a hard choice that's the correct choice, we need to be there to support them, basically. Because, I mean, with housing, of course, there's tons of really hard choices that we ask our politicians to make. Yeah, so I, I see a pretty strong parallel there. Makes sense, man. Um, yeah, is there anything else you want to say about it? Oh, I got a hand raised. Yeah, vote no on Prop 6. <laughs> All right, thank you.